I started watching The Daily Show in 1999. Uh, it's my freshman year at North Carolina State University, and a man by the name of Jon Stewart had just taken over the show. And I was a fan from the beginning. I thought it was hilarious. Uh, but also the show kind of challenged the way I looked at the world. And it sounds crazy, but it actually helped me in evolving my own views. 2006, I was still watching the show when I picked up my life, moved to Los Angeles to become a filmmaker uh, by attending USC's School of Cinematic Arts. For my master's thesis, I set out to do a documentary about stand-up comedy in South Africa. And in fact, The Daily Show and John talking about comedy as catharsis directly influenced me making that film. Because during apartheid in South Africa, you didn't really see comedians of color on stage. Uh, so when I arrived there in 2008, it had only been 12 years or so where you had black comedians performing. And there was definitely very much this cathartic through line, if you will, of what we joke about all this heavy stuff on stage, you know, that happened in our history as a way of processing it. And that's where I started with the documentary because I had been informed partially from watching The Daily Show and seeing how you get comedy from tragedy. And then on that trip, you know, to South Africa, first time I'm there, you know, in 2008, I meet a young up and coming comedian by the name of Trevor Noah, who would end up becoming the main focus of my documentary. And, you know, as he and I were getting to know each other, I said to him, hey, I'm a fan of The Daily Show. You should watch it. I think you'd like it. And he was like, yeah, OK, I will. So Trevor and I would go on to work on many projects together. We became great friends. And then imagine the full circle moment when I get a call from him early 2015 and he says, hey, uh, I just want you to know that I'm going to be the next host of The Daily Show and I want you to come through and be a part of that. It was an amazing seven year run with Trevor at The Daily Show, capped off by the show winning outstanding talk series at the Emmys this year. And at that point, I kind of thought, where does one go from here? You know, that's kind of it, right? And then we get the news that Jon Stewart is coming back. These full circle moments, they keep on happening. It's unbelievable, the series of events that brought me here. Honestly, I don't think I'll ever win the lottery because I've used up all my luck getting here to this place, but I'm excited to keep on making the most of it.